Hey, welcome back. It's Jim Shirley again. And what I promised to show you in this video is basically how to set up this video post using a few photos from your computer um, that you've taken of your business, and then how to set up uh, and promote that post on Facebook. So here I am inside of Facebook on my personal business page, uh, which is called Results Press. And um, if you don't already have a Facebook fan page, they're actually really easy to create and they're free. So all you have to do is just, once you log in with your personal information, just go over and uh, click on the, the arrow. This is something that's easiest to do from your computer. Um, and then click to create a page. So you can also do this from your phone. Um, so uh, just the menus look a little different, but just create a page. It'll walk you through all the steps. You upload a picture and and all of that stuff. Um, and you know that's something that you know as a business we can help with. And and uh, you know if you don't have the time for it. Um, but the main point is once you have that fan page, then you can start using Facebook for advertising. And um, all we have to do is uh, go ahead and go in here and write a post just like uh, you would in your personal Facebook. So. Uh, you've got all these different post types when you have a fan page and a couple more options here than you do in your personal Facebook like get phone calls advertise your business what we're gonna do though is share a photo or video so uh, we'll just click that and then um, that's gonna open up and it's gonna give you a couple of options here now the one in particular I like to use uh, with businesses and what I'm kind of illustrating in this video is this slideshow video where we're just going to take anywhere between three and ten photos. Um, I like to use five and uh, basically all we have to do is upload. So see down here it's kind of hard to see when you first are using this but you basically have this area with these plus signs where you can upload pictures. So you can take a photo um, if you're on your phone for example um, if you've already got a bunch of photos in your Facebook library, um, you can pick from there, or you can upload photos from your computer. Okay, so all this really requires is that you use your smartphone or use a camera and basically get some photos of your business. And like I said, you know, if you're a restaurant, for example, you know, having that glass of wine on the bar, having a beautiful picture of, of plated food, um, you know, having a picture of the entrance, having a picture of people, you know, your staff, a couple of your staff working, uh, you know, those are, those are all great photos. These don't have to be like stock photos. In fact, you want to avoid stock photos and instead use real pictures of your real people in uh, your real business. So I'm going to X out of that. Um, so all you have to do is just once you have some pictures uploaded is pick the ones you want to use and then say add those photos okay and then it's gonna create a slideshow for you now what I recommend just you know quick things let's not focus on this for too long um, is you can change this duration of each of your pictures here um, keep in mind if you're like a service-based business and you don't have a lot of pictures you could always make slides like PowerPoint slides and upload those as images um, I like to transition between the slides in a fade type transition so the picture sort of fades out and then you can actually uh, add music right in so yeah, there you go right so uh, Facebook will automatically append the music right to the length of your video so Boom, that easy. And uh, then all you have to do is say create slideshow. Okay, so now before they go and turn that into a video for you, um, what they're going to do is kind of give you this post thing here. And just don't forget to say something about your post. And, you know, if you're a business, this is a great place, uh, since this is an advertisement, to, uh, you know, tell people that this is a limited offer, for example, or, you know, Tell people how you want them to reach out to you. Uh, you know, so for example, um, you know, for a limited time, you know, get 10% off, you know, or if you're a restaurant, like the example I used earlier, you know, it could be get a free, you know, mention this ad and, and get a free drink, you know, that kind of thing. 
give people a reason to come in and uh, make sure they know what to do. So, you know, if, it, if, if they're supposed to call you, if they're supposed to visit your website, um, if they're supposed to, you know, whatever it is, make sure you save it up here. Okay. And then once you're all done, all you have to do is click publish. And uh, you can go straight into boosting the post, which is kind of the thing we're going to be doing next. Um, I like to just go ahead and post it uh, first. So let's do that. And then you'll see what happens here is they just kind of generate this video for you. So I'm going to uh, sit here just for a second, let that go. Okay, so that finished editing and uh, being created. So now the reason I don't like to go straight into boosting the post is because there's a couple of other things we can do here. Um, now what you can do is once the post is ready, hit this little drop down and say edit post. Okay, so this is one of the power things we want to be able to do. Now this is where you want to give your video a title and you want to use your business name here. So um, go ahead and you know add your business name and then add some tags. So uh, you know again your business name uh, makes a great tag. Um, you may also you know just in the the text of your post want to use a few hashtags if uh, if you know some related to your business. So you know make those couple of little edits and then uh, then you're good to go okay uh, then save it now you're ready to boost this post okay so click boost now so far we're at six minutes and 45 seconds on the recording here so you can see the actual time and uh, I did promise this would only take a couple of minutes so what happens when you get ready to boost the post is um, you can add a button okay so uh, you know, if you're a service business, you might want to say like book now or learn more. Um, you know, if you're a, a e-commerce type business, you might want to say shop now or send message, that kind of thing. Um, and all that does is just, it adds a button down below. So, uh, and then next, what you want to do is uh, go ahead and target your audience. Now, if you have any problems, you know, up here, you may... Uh, find that Facebook is going to give you a warning. Um, so that's okay. Uh, we can look at the advertising policies. Um, something about my post, you know, that is, is something they don't like. It's probably that there's too much text in one of my pictures here. So um, we can ignore that safely for now. And then just make sure you uh, choose people through targeting and, you know, pick your state, your city, your local area, and then pick the age group that are likely to buy from you. You know, there's no sense in including people on Facebook who are underage, um, who don't have a credit card, for example, for example, um, um, who, you know, aren't going to be the ones buying at your restaurant. Um, so, uh, you know, that that's something to look for there. And then just basically set a daily budget and then tell it the duration. So I like to just say $10 over, you know, seven days, for example, or just run it for five days. Um, and then basically you can uh, go from there and click boost. So what we'll do, I'll, I'll end the video there because we're uh, fast approaching nine minutes here. And um, I'll go into some more targeting detail and other information in uh, the third part of this video series. If you want to watch that, then basically go ahead on this page and opt in. Um, there's a couple of things I talk about in that video, which I don't really want to share with just everybody, um, especially uh, competitors and that kind of thing. So um, there's some really good stuff in there. Won't cost you a thing. All I ask is for your email address so I can send you the link to get to uh, that next video. And uh, I promise it'll be worthwhile for you. So I look forward to uh, seeing you over there. And thanks a lot for joining me here.